Hi, Venus on. Welcome back to the channel. It's me, Abby Kareen, your Philly Neighborhood Nerd, and we are back with season three of Community. Ah! As you can see, I'm wearing the same clothes I wore for season two because I'm rolling right into three. I took a little break because uh, the, the post conversation for episode uh, 24 was was a it was a bit heavy for me. It was it was it was a lot of opening up to you. So if you did not get a chance to watch the the inning, you might want to check it out. It just kind of gives a lot of uh, insight to to why I think the way I do about certain characters like Pierce. Let's just be honest. But um, but yeah, we're gonna jump in to season three, and this one's called my favorite topic, one o one biology. What's good? <laughs> I am very much into science, especially biology. That's my favorite type of science. I love uh, this. It's so biology is the study of living things, um, organisms. I love looking through telescopes and seeing all the different organisms, single cell creatures that uh, sprout in our water. <laughs> I love it. So this, this, I mean, it will have nothing to do with biology, but I will say I love biology and I love science. <laughs> if you'd like to check out the full reaction to this episode, you can find it on my Patreon. There we are three weeks ahead. Don't forget to like, leave a comment and subscribe and follow me on my social media. Let's do this. I'm like, we're gonna be like crazy. <laughs> we're gonna finally be fine. Right. At first I didn't know what to think about this, but I love musicals, but like... <laughs> Jeff! Oh. Oh, sorry. Look at him now with like blonder hair. Got Pierce in the study group this year. We'll be okay. I'm sure we'll figure it out. How you like me now, bitches? Oh. Team, you seem different. Are you in a play right now? Over the summer, I decided it's time to whip this place into shape. I'm gonna be a mean, lean, deaning machine. Absolutely not. After Annie's boobs. See, this is the kind of national lampoonery that is coming to an end this year. Oh, but won't that be exhausting to you? Hey guys, let's get to biology on time. I don't want to be a screw up this year. That's chemistry. Yeah. Well, there you go. How's your summer? Enlightful, Annie. I underwent three months of intensive soul rezoning at the Laser Lotus Celebrity Center. Oh. Has a, has a sort of magic in it. Aww. And I'd like to come back. Yeah. Damn it! <laughs> Jeff, I'm kind of with you. I mean, yay! I had the frustrating realization that you can't come back to the group oh. because you're not in biology and it's all filled up. Well, couldn't we take something else? I think we've evolved beyond reliance on a group at all. Aren't we just actual friends now, no matter where we are? Yeah. You know what's magic about this table? It magically keeps our books from falling on the floor. The <laughs> I mean, that's fair. He can still come hang out. It's not like they really study. I mean, we don't see them studying. <laughs> but I mean, that's okay. That's like every... I'm monkey, I'm living here. It was him scampering around. Huh. He really seems like he's changed. What are you, nuts? No. That's what he wants you to think. You actually have to give it time to see if someone's really changed. Crazy last year. Wrong. Being crazy drove him excluded. What's wrong? Cougar Town's been moved to mid-season. That's never a good sign. And I watched the episode, or I saw the, the clip on YouTube. Thank you for whoever sent that to me. It took me 6,205 hours to get my degree. And I know, because I was only allowed in the library one hour per day at the San Vicente Correctional Facility. What? Life? <laughs> That's a good intro. That's a Sorry. great intro. Um, He's going to stab you. Vibrate. <laughs> I stared at a crack in the ground of myself for years. And one day, something grew from it. A single blade of grass. Mm. Vibrates louder than the ringer. Yeah, it is. Gosh. Nature finds a way. Oh my. <laughs> oh, it's off. It's off. Out. Get out of here. Is he? <gasps> I'm leaving. Don't bother coming back. Oh Seriously? no. Hey dude, Sean Penn called. He says to dial it back. Sean Penn is an actor. I know who Sean Penn is. I've seen Milk. Now get out. 
So Pierce is going to take his spot and then the tables have been turned. Prepares Golanek. Vice Dean. Dean, you shoot. You Dean, Vice Dean. That you use school funds to buy an espresso machine for your faculty break room. I don't recall being consulted on that. An appendage on a body with a head. And this head is saying to this appendage, what's up? What's up? Dean. You bring your head down to my appendage tomorrow and I'll show you what's up. I'll be there. <laughs> <laughs> let's, <laughs> let's take him a bit more seriously. I don't know. I don't know what he just signed up for. Why would we need to do that? I'm not in biology anymore. And neither is Pierce, but you're both still our friends. Mm -hmm. We've evolved. Yeah. That's true. It's hard, though. It's hard to be like, oh, I'm not going to be with my friends in this. I'm, I'm going to be losing experiences. And we all love each other. Mm -hmm. And we all go to the same school. So, uh... I guess I'll see you when I see you. I was on the wait list for biology. Somebody got kicked out. I am here to study. Man, taste of his own medicine. Huh? Why did everyone on Cougar to Navi just die? They only ran six episodes. That's the great thing about British TV. They give you closure. Oh. <laughs> he needs the replacement. Buddy. Oh no. Is he shedding? You're a human tennis elbow. You are a pizza burn on the roof of the world's mouth. You are the opposite of Batman. Oh, here, jeez, we're just getting right into it. Real Dean coming through. Oh my goodness. Wow. Gracious. Our alumni donations comprise 80% of your entire school's budget. And you want to know why we think we deserve an espresso machine? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Well, I guess I didn't know. Oh my gosh. He plays some great villains. Oh, brother, where art thou? To die a happy pansexual imp. But you wanted to feel power this year. Well, now you're going to feel my power as it surges downward. Oh my god. What is this? Who are these guys? This is my legal team. Because I think it's time we worked out a new agreement. He doesn't look like a lawyer. That's a barber. A, yeah, that's a barber. Because I'm also sick of that ridiculous goatee. <gasps> you look like a white Lou Gossett Jr. He looks he looks like a skinny, more dainty Walter White. Okay, leave him alone. Prison was my walls, but you put your walls up. You and your phone and your attitude and your fruit loops cologne. He's calling you out. Even a blade of grass could get through. But even if it did, you wouldn't appreciate it. Or did Pierce hire him? In Busted! And <laughs> he runs. Hey, what take it the easy, hell? Everything okay? It is now. And I have this. This is my ticket to getting back in the group. Hey! Is it all a conspiracy? Oh no. That's not poison, is this? Oh no, it is. Choke. While people are in school. Oh my god. Is this where he gets the oh my god? Oh my gosh, he's tripping out. Oh god. What is going on? <laughs> He's become British sci-fi series that's been on the air since is it, 1960. Is it uh, Doctor Who? You've done enough, okay? But if it's Doctor Who, that's uh, that'd be pretty awesome. A good job because it's a ruiner's club. You ruined my analogy. Guys, look. Inspector Space Time. Okay, so it's it's a runoff or it's a joke on Doctor Who. Y'all, I'm so sad I watched season one of Doctor Who and I recorded it, but I lost all the files. <laughs> but like, I want to... the best show I've ever seen in my life. I oh loved my season one, and now y'all don't get to see it. Jeff, 
What happened? You look 70. The beginning with his pal, Professor Kane. Jeff, that's a photo I gave our professor of me visiting Hawthorne Wipe's spokesman and rap artist Sugar Cube in prison during the night. Well, that's not fair! Look, I, 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 He's turning into Pierce. Oh, the prison uniform! Oh, Jeffrey. Oh, come on. Obviously, I don't mean all black people are in prison. Oh! oh hey, Jeff! This is so trippy. This needs some space. I just came by to tell everyone this year isn't going to be that different. With the notable exception, we really won't have any money. The Dean needs a hug and a cocktail. I was lying the whole time. I didn't want the group to evolve. I just didn't want Pierce around. I'm gonna have to ask that you stop being my friend. Is this some fever dream he's having? Look, everybody hears the thing. Because I know Pierce has done far worse than the biology class was full. So Neil I told Professor Kane I'd pay him a few thousand dollars. Kid trip out. What? A what? Yes. It is a scary, lonely, Chang-filled world out there. I'm sure, this group has sprouted some legs, but why are we in such a rush to leave the Thai pool? When they were really about to vote him out so quickly. He didn't bribe from anyone in his life. You feel me? Yeah, I lied, but you seem to have a harder time being the bad guy than me. Well, I'm not worried about it. Life has a way of breaking through. That's true. What did he learn? Oh, couldn't we get like a Breaking Bad type of thing going? Sorry, Starface. You just lost your seat in my class. I love that. Now the table is good as new. <coughs> so is Abed. Rita, I'm sorry I was overprotective of Abed. I'll try and be more supportive of you. Well, here's your first chance. Helping Abed has inspired me to finally declare a major. I'm going to study psychology. Oh, okay research capacity no in a hands-on capacity i'm gonna be a therapist okay hey 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 keep it down <gasps> <What did you? laughs> it all this is the year we all die <laughs> it all makes sense oh i love it oh that's fab um oh my gosh Chang as security makes perfect sense in my mind and it's a fantasy I did not know I wanted. <laughs> um, okay, I'll try not make this one as long as the last one. It's, I remember, I think when they were first talking, it was last season when they were first talking about voting um, Pierce out of the group. I think maybe it was Jeff who had said something like, uh, something about how voting people in and oh, maybe it wasn't Jeff but someone had something about you know voting can, could lead to like dangerous waters almost I didn't say anything like that but like that's the kind of idea um and here we saw it again where they were just like really quick to be like okay which is really stupid because it's just like of all the stuff that Pierce has done all the traumatic stuff Pierce has done it's not the same or at least in my view it's not the same as Jeff because Jeff Oh, well, I mean, I guess in a se I don't know, because I guess it is, because they're, they were both lonely being out of the group. But Jeff normally doesn't make, doesn't go out of his way to, like, hurt people or make them, or put them in bad situations like Pierce has done many a times last season. Like, okay, the whole every black man looks like, that's just like a dude dude but like everyone in the group has done something probably just as bad if we all go back to my beautiful woman Britt Marling in that one Valentine's episode um Britta you know was assuming she was a lesbian and that's the only reason why she wanted to be her friend so it's just like you know there's a bit of give and take so that was a that voting was a bit like hypocritical in my, in my opinion but teach her own whatever it was entertaining uh and I loved the crazy like <laughs> dreams uh Jeff was having but but at the end of the day Jeff got a little bit of perspective of someone else which is very important because because it does give you a bit of uh understanding and even empathy for them so it's just like we'll see if Pierce does 
change a little. I mean, it doesn't have to like be perfect or anything. It's just like, don't do as many terrible things and we'll be good. That's all it is. <laughs> I'm also glad Abed found his new show. Very funny. It's pretty much Doctor Who. Oh, I'll have to get back into that because I love Doctor Who. I loved the first Doctor. Um, what is it? I forgot his name. He was so great, though. I loved him and him and Rose. <laughs> Sorry, I'm gushing about that now. British shows are pretty amazing. I love Luther. I love Doctor Who. And there was this other one with, uh, it's so dumb. It has uh, uh, Tom Hardy and he's like this young, was he, was he a mobster? I don't know. It's something crazy. But yeah, the, there's some good British shows out there. But anyway, really fun. Glad I watched it. Can't wait to watch episode two. <laughs> All right, but that's it. I will see y'all in the next video. Bye.